Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by, and of course, you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another campground virtual tour. Today, we are visiting the Lakewood Recreation Area. This is on the Guadalupe River. It is managed by the Guadalupe Blanco River Authority. I'm going to be using two different cameras for this virtual tour. We're going to be on the Vituvia e-bike. I like to refer to as the Valkyrie. So let's get on the Valkyrie and go check out Lakewood Recreation Area. Give me a minute. I got to put all my camera stuff where it goes. Hold on, gotta make a camera adjustment. Okay, thank you for, for being patient with me as I get my cameras situated. It is June, middle of June. It's starting to get warm. Heat indexes are getting up into the triple digits. Thanks to lots of humidity. There's some things about the Lakewood Recreation Area campground that really appeal to me. And then there's some things that, yeah, not so much. And you'll see what I mean when we get down here. That's rough. Well, that's a county road. There's about a dozen houses that, we, that, that are back down in there. There are three pull-through sites here on the right. It's kind of confusing as to how you get into them. I just kind of roll through them. There was no one here to ask questions of. They're pull through at 50 amp, but there's no sewer. Now here on the left, a little gray block building, that is the restroom. According to a sign over there, there's a boat ramp restoration project going, but the boat ramp is high and dry. Because the lake is low and pretty much non-existent.
This is a very beautiful little setting. All these big, huge pecan trees down here. road is rather rough, undeveloped. Of course, according to the high water mark in 1983, this was all underground. I mean underwater, not underground, underwater. Campsites, camp, the RV campsites are all here on the left. They use picnic area on the right. Now, according to the website for the Blanco River, the, the Guadalupe Blanco River Authority, there's a 14 day limit on campsites. I'm kind of thinking that uh, some folks don't know how to count. Really, there's only four sites available. We get down here into the primitive. Oh, there's a deer. We'll loop back around so y'all can look into the campsites on the Hero. Now the 360 will, virtual tour will come out tomorrow. And if you're watching on your cell phone, all you have to do is move your cell phone and you'll be able to look behind me as I'm riding through. Or you can put on the Oculus headset, one of those virtual reality goggle setups. That's a pretty location. Apparently there's been a lot of people drowned in here on the river. So they advise you not to swim. Change in elevation. This is the put in location for the Guadalupe River Paddling Trail.
That's the dam that doesn't seem to be damaged. The damn dam that ain't damaged. All right, we're going to cruise back through. One more time, unto the breach. Such a pretty, pretty location. Just in your angle so you'll be able to see better into those campground campsites. We won't go back to that little primitive loop though. Just the RV side. Just a moment.
Just a minute, we're getting there. That brings us, well that brings us to the end of this virtual tour. Lakewood Recreation Area on the Guadalupe River. I hope you enjoyed that little ride along. I hope you gained some valuable insight as to another public campground in the state of Texas. If you're still with me at this point, thank you so much. Hold on. Got a spider web on my face. Thank you so much if you're still with me at this point. If you've not already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button and remember to hit that bell as well. You don't want to miss another episode of the Dude Derby Traveling Road Show. And for those of you who have been following along, thank you. I cannot express it enough. Thank you so very much. That's why I get to do what I do. You guys are looking in, in, on the 360. Y'all are y'all are staring into the back of my truck, aren't you? It's a mess. <laughs> For my patrons, we're so grateful. You guys rock. All right, y'all come back now. You hear?